this video is part of my new book called Unofficial Beginner's Guide to Roblox Scripting. If you want to get this book, it's entirely optional. There are links in the description. Hello everyone, it is your favorite Roblox scripting teacher. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to publish your own game. Now, you've created your game and you've gotten your instance.news right here from the last video. We've gotten five instance.news, we've got five parts. If you click on play, you'll see that in test mode, you've got your five parts. As shown in the last video, you can knock them all over. Now, the question is, how do I get other people to play my game? How can I enable my game such that other people can play it? That is something called publishing. All you have to do is click on file, click publish to Roblox. So you can set the name, which I'm calling the scripting book game. You can set the description. So I'm just going to say, this is my awesome game. You can select the creator, which is by default me, but you can also select it to be created by a group. So if I wanted it to be created by a group, I can select it over here. But to do this, you do have to have group access. So I'm just going to leave it as me. You can select a genre. So I'm just going to say this is just leave it as all. And these right here are the devices that your game will be played on. So I'm just going to keep things basic and say it's just going to be for computers, phones and tablet. And then team create is an option that allows other people to edit your game with you. So if you want to invite other people to also edit your game, you can turn this on. I'm going to leave it off because I'm going to be the only person that's editing this game. Then you can click create and then Roblox will publish your game and you can click close. And now if you go back to your Roblox create page, create.roblox.com, I'm just going to refresh this so everything reloads and if you look under experiences, you'll see that your game is right there. So now if you click on it, or if you click on view on Roblox, you will see that your game actually has a game page and you are able to play it. However, other people are not able to play this game. So by default, Roblox actually makes your game private. And if you want other people to play your game, you're going to want to click on these three dots and you're going to want to click on make public. Now you can see this green bright public text. And that means that other people are able to play your game. So now if you click on view on Roblox, you can actually copy this URL and you can send it to other people and other people will be able to play your awesome game. So now I'm going to click on play just to show you what it's going to look like. I'm going to click on open Roblox and Roblox will load. And then as it loads, suddenly I'm in my game and I've got my five parts that I coded using my trusty instance.new. So now that I'm in the top of my parts, I'm just going to knock it all over again. Bam, there go my parts. And that is the end of this video. If you enjoyed watching this video, please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.